An East Tennessee man convicted of murdering a teenage girl more than 43 years ago is up for parole. Randy Lee May was found guilty in the July 1980 murder of 16 year old Mary Jones. May's parole hearing is Thursday and the victim's family members are fearing the worst. Kylie Hill with our sister station in the Tri Cities brings us this story. In 1980, Randy Lee May posed as a law enforcement officer and persuaded two teenage girls to get into his car. He drove them into the woods where he then committed violent acts, including the murder of 16 year old Mary Jones. Mary and a friend were on a walk in these woods in Morristown, Tennessee, when Randy Lee May approached them. He stopped them and asked them to help him find some kids from their school that they knew that had run away. And he had a badge, handcuffs, a gun, everything, because he was going to school to be a cop. So they thought they could trust him and went with him. Misty Denman and Jamie Conkin are Mary's nieces. They say May slashed Mary's throat and stabbed her multiple times. May was later convicted of murder and attempted murder and sentenced to 16 years in prison. He's been up for parole multiple times and denied, but now scheduled to appear again on August 24th. At one of the parole hearings, they said to our family's face, it's not if we let him out, it's when. Family telling me they live in fear every day, even with him in prison. We have all these fears because we know what's out there and what people are capable of doing. And, you know, he's affecting generations that he never even knew would exist, you know, and we don't want that. They say the memory of what happened on July 20th, 1980 will forever haunt their family the day Mary was murdered. I've, I've seen the evil, you know, like we all know there's evil, but when it's that close, it's just different. It's just different. Now, 43 years later, they continue to fight to keep Mary's murderer behind bars. If we didn't do what we do, I think he would have been released a long time ago. Yeah. We've literally been doing petitions for 20 something years. We relive it all the time. All the time. And that's stupid. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not fair. It's like... unnecessary. As they wait for his parole hearing, Jamie and Misty fearful of the outcome. When do we get a little peace? You know, like, at what point are you all going to say, okay, fine, this family's been through this, they've experienced this. Over and over again.